everyone, this is Giselle, and today is my second day here in Akone, a beautiful hot spring town fairly close to Tokyo. My itinerary today will be centered around Lake Ashi where with some luck, the magnificent Mount Fuji can be seen. I'll start the day with a visit to the shrine of Akone Jinja, located at the foot of Mount Akone and hidden within the dense forest. This shrine dates back to the year 757, so yeah, it's pretty old. Samurai warriors used to come here for worship to guide them in battle. But today, the shrine is said to bring good luck and safety. One of the classic images of Japan is the red Torigi seemingly floating on the water with Mount Fuji in the background. This is the Heiwa no Tori, or Gate of Peace, which is one of the Tori gates of Akone Shrine. This is a very touristy and famous photo spot, well, for obvious reasons. Because of this, long lines can build up pretty quick, so I recommend coming here early, maybe around 8am to avoid the crowd. Next stop, still along Lake Ashi, is the Hakone Sekisho. So Hakone used to be an important checkpoint to control traffic along Tokaido, the highway which linked Tokyo with Kyoto during the Edo period. Hakone Sekisho is a replica of what used to be a checkpoint here in Hakone, complete with gates, fence, housing for officers and foot soldiers, a prison chamber, and a lookout tower. Behind is a hill where an even better view of the lake can be seen, as well as the passing of pirate ships, which is actually my next activity. More on that later. There's also the Hakone Sekisho Shiryokan, a small museum with various related exhibits. Nearby is a small tea house, so I think I'm gonna have a little rest and snack. It looks so delicious. Itadakimasu! This dango is so soft and chewy. Plus, Another nice view of Lake Ashi. Mm -hmm. 
one does not visit Lake Ashi and not board the Hakone Pirate Ship. Cruising the lake for around 40 minutes, this trip offers a great view of the surround mountains of Okone and of course Mount Fuji. This is my stop, the Togandai Port, where the Togandai Station of Okone Ropeway is located. This will take me to my next destination. Kudani is a crater of Mount Kamiyama. This area is an active volcanic zone, so you'll notice sulfuric fumes rising from the bare surface of the mountain. Dry food here is a local specialty called kuro tamago or black egg. The eggs are cooked in Owakudani's hot spring and the shells turn black due to a chemical reaction with the sulfur. It is said that eating just one egg adds seven years to your life. Itadakimasu! It actually tastes like a normal boiled egg, but the smell is different. This wraps up my today's itinerary. If you like this video, please hit like and consider subscribing and click the notification bell so you will be alerted for my next video, which is my third and last day here in Akane, where I visited a famous museum and crossed the longest suspension bridge in Japan. I'm Giselle and join me again next time as we go see Japan!